You ready? Let's see the knife. Pretty rare. That's uh, not as easy as you think. Stab it and hold it there. Don't get fucking a, stab it. Get, get a clean spot. You might want to back up. If I hit the same spot. One more. Get my arms. Woo. Woo. That was a deep one. Nice. <laughs> Have a good day. All right. Torture test. GW knives. Going to hack through this 2x4. And then a cinder block. So I'm going to make a YouTube video and I'm going to speed up through all the boring stuff and uh, just show the important stuff. Unless something catastrophic happens, then obviously I'll show you that. So good luck GW Knives. A little slippery with these gloves on. Smooth G10 scales. A little slippery. All right, I'm gonna flip this over. I'm stop the video for a second. All right, I'm back. Could be a little longer for chopping. But, uh... Not bad. Could be a little longer and heavier for chopping tasks such as this, but they got the job done. All right. Cinder block coming up next. All right, here we go. Same knife. Not sharpened. And attempt to crash this thing in half. I put my glasses on.
again, a little hard to hold on to with the gloves. Getting a little flat. We're through. Right now, my only complaint is the handle too slippery doesn't want to stay on and the edges of this guy right here are pretty sharp and I can feel it on my pinky every time I come down I'm trying to keep up as high as I can to start but it slides down pretty quick and game over catastrophic failure Find that little peak, glue it back together. She made a hole, but I did not break it in half like I wanted to. Wood, no problem. But I would not suggest chipping a cinder block in half with this.